Better be careful of that edge. Oh. Oh, fuck. I ran out of key. Oh. Fuck sakes, you long haired, two horned son of a bitch. Ugh. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Noisy Boy here, welcome back to the channel. In today's new 2 video, we're going to be continuing on with the story mode, but before we get started guys, remember if you have been enjoying this series so far, remember to smash the like button because it really helps out the channel if you're new. Feel free to subscribe because I'd love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comment section below. Now we are done with this region, um, I, what I've been pretty much doing, I think I mentioned it in the last episode, I'm actually going to start skipping these submissions. Um, I've been counting it and it's just going to be 50, 60 plus videos. I know it's a let's play but at the same time the submissions are just the main quests either in reverse or places have been cut off. Unless it has like a main boss or Kadamas, I probably won't record it from now on. I know I've already done a few of them, like you look at that submission there, it had two of them, you know that's got three. I'll do those ones and record them as well so that should take out a big chunk because a 50, 60 odd let's play is fucking a lot so... And just to my equipment as well, just pretty much um, upgraded a little bit, not too much, but um, going through those other submissions and uh, submissions and getting all the stuff, so it's not really that bad. But at the same time, look at that enhanced blessing, beautiful, beautiful. I actually talking about blessings. Not sure if I actually mentioned it, but I was taking the elixir blessing. But I switched it over to the Oracle Blessing, I think it was 2 or 3 videos ago, so that gives me 25% extra Amrita. And you've got that other 20% on top of that, so we're looking at, what, 29% extra Amrita per kill. And I also need to, I think what I'm going to do too is, I've kept a lot of my stats at base, but what I'm going to do is I might raise some of them up, so... <clears throat> and I've also got Poison Shurikens too, so... Just to try to work up my ninjutsu a bit quicker, because I notice I haven't really been doing much. I've been throwing the odd bomb here and there, but I need to use it more often to work it up. Um, and I took off ground, paralytic ground too, so let's uh, move on to the next episode. I'm probably using the ground paralytic, ground fire paralytic, paralytic ground fire I should say. I'll probably be using that more towards the end of my build, just to cat, like, um capture like humanoid bosses and shit like that. You know, it all makes sense to you later on when I'm finished, but at least I've got it now. Oh, it's the next region. Beautiful. And at the same time, I'll be doing stuff in this region, so depending on how big the region is. Oh, Nobunaga. He was the main antagonist in the, well not the main, but you know, one of the big bosses in the last game. And also too, because the main missions take sometimes two, maybe three videos to complete, so, you know what I mean, it just, each region would just take so much you know, videos, so, like I said, I'll cut out the submissions unless it's got Kadam's or a main boss in it that is, um, you know, really, you know, pinnacle to the main story, so. Oh, young Nobunaga. He's very young. Obviously, for those you don't know, this is a prequel to Neo 1. God looks badass. Damn. Oh, and the missus. 
I'm not sure. Because I'm pretty sure she was part of the problem in the second Neo too, on the first Neo as well. I'm just not sure if she's gone that far yet. Okay, here we are. Soaring. Region 2. Nice. Okay, so we'll do the hidden members of Okay Zami, Zima. So we'll probably get all this done. We get the Master's Archers one and some Samurai Locks for doing it too, but like I was saying previously before, if it's like part of the main mission or they have Kodamas, I will record it. So I know I'll be skipping a lot. Like, I'm not sure how many main missions are in this region, so they might be cut a lot short, but I just have to do it because that first region took so long to do. Like, this is part 10 or something like that, so. But yeah, guys. 10 videos for the. F well, 9 videos for the first region. There's like 5 or 6 of them, so. Charge! Kill them all! Ooh! Spear, bro! Doing some work! Mataza! Oh, oh! Pickled! I'm seeing us now. See, it's funny, this. Yes, it's us. See, this time in um, you know, their history, a lot of lore, a lot of wars, a lot of provinces warring with each other. A good time to make a game. And I think they're like, the majority of the games, like Dynasty Warriors and all that, are all. Over. I actually need some of those too. I need some um, Choco Choco Cups. Because I don't have any, fuck. Uh, but yeah, a lot of movies, games, they're all based around this time. Which is pretty good, you know, so. I guess we'll find out, but I want to just fight this guy first. He's got a duchy, so he'll be a beefy bro. Oh, sorry, smoke bomb at me, you bitch. As you can see, the it's not taking off too much health, but if I can get him in slow and then hit them with poison, that's not a bad start to a fight, so. That's not bad as well, so you see that. Got two Ochoco Cups from that, I might be able to bring someone along with me. Just let me pass, dude. Oh wait. Gesture. Uh, let's give him uh, this one, bring it on then. Oh, oh he dropped his nuts. You don't want to sue my wrist with me, buddy? Pick you up, looks like that might be able to be kicked down for a shortcut to here. Let's get our shit back. See, I'll be trying to hit them with probably two or three. Like, it's I'm not very good in the old um, nin ninjutsu or the shuriken tree, so like just trying to get them poisoned and ticked away might be a good idea for now. And it'll be a good way to work on my ninjutsu too. I thought I could hear something. I want to get rid of that back step too. That's all I've got, but I'm going to get rid of it. I know there's a kick you can pick out too. Oh shit. And that kick actually busts up a lot of their keys, so. Get down, son. Mm. Oh, it looks like there's a Shudama on the other side. Looks like I've got to knock down that tree too. 
All right, well, this must be another shortcut. That's pretty much what this game is about. It unlocks so many shortcuts, different ways to go to one spot. Whereas a lot of these Souls-like games are quite linear. Got two little douchebags over there. Oh, I step forward, shit. Oh, you little bastard. Oh, wait, the hell? Didn't I kill that dude? Which way? It looks like that way might be the way to progress. I came through where that blue door, blue sword is. So, what's down here? Nothing on the roof. I've noticed that I don't check the roof of my other games, other episodes at all. I should try and do that more often. Ooh. Looks like there's a guy in there too. And by the looks of things, there's a Kadama in his room too. I hate fighting these guys, just beef up. And then try to get him to slow just like that, because you can see it's ticking away. And I've slowed him too, so it makes this fight a hell of a lot easier. Like if I try to do up the whole toxic thing or the poison thing, it'd probably take along a bit more, but like I said before, this isn't going to be a ninjutsu build, but I do need to try and get it up for like um, the dojo later on. So there's another Kodama in here too. Ah oh, yes. That Kodama sensor, so good. But like, the thing I don't do is I don't check the bloody map, so... Like we've got a screamer there. Nothing behind there that's gonna come up and try to get, stab me in the ass. See if I can sneak up on him and get him a backstab. Got you ass hat. Like I don't mind that backstepping slash, but I'd rather the kick because it actually decimates their key. And if I can get their key down and there'd be like a free uh, grapple or final blow which is powerful <laughs> holy did I come from there? Or did I, I think I came from there okay let's go this way it's the item I thought was a lantern Alright, outside in the rain once again. Oh, Sadama. Um, I think I didn't mention before, you can actually drop soul cores to, to try and get the Kadama soul core. I don't think I showed that. But I think I've got two of them now. And if you're wondering what the Kadama um, core does, I think it gives you like, I think every one of them gives you like 20% to your. Kodama uh, blessings, so or is it ten percent? Oh, nice. Here's that shortcut. Don't need it. I'm pretty good in everything else, so I might as well just keep rocking on. And if I die, it's a quick shortcut straight back to here. But yeah, I have got the Kodama blessing on my secondary, just so that I've got that extra blessing, like I was speaking about before. And these are the things you have to think about when you're putting a character together. Not just your strength and shit like that, you have to be able to... What is that progression? You have to be able to earn gold and... You know, equipment drop rates and soul drop rates and... Active key skill consumption and dodging and all that shit, so... And I think I might actually put some... It's probably another thing I should mention too, is I'm probably going to put some more points into... Strength and stamina to try and get medium and heavy gear. Ah, I knew it. Oh fuck. 
Oh fuck. Yeah, take that. I hate these little bastards. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful of that edge, so. Oh, 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 fuck my keys out. Oh, fuck's sakes. You long haired, two horned son of a bitch. Ugh. Oh. Anyway, back again. I'm gonna fuck this guy up. I don't care what the fuck he does. Revenge kill, bitch. Slow your roll. Get straight back into you. Nah, you ain't doing shit. Get the fuck down. Ugh. I hate those fucking things. They're almost as bad as... Oh, scampers. They're almost as bad as those... Snake ladies. Fuck, I hate fighting those snake ladies. They are the worst. They hit like a truck. They poison, they paralyze. Oh. And just slow this asshole down too. I feel like we're fighting Inkies a lot lately. Oh, almost jumped off the edge. Get the fuck down, what do you think this is? Oh yeah, take that. Not today, you son of a bitch. Oh, the edge. Oh, scampers. With the final death blow. Sacrifice himself to do the oh no, it's still there. Oh no, got a dark realm. What's up here? Okay, so there's another. Wait a sec. Oh no, I guess I could come back there. Let's go try to take up this dark realm first. And see, with this game, there's usually two paths to the same place. There's usually an easy way and a hard way. But the the hard way yields better rewards. Obviously, it's harder. Just gotta watch your corners and your edges and shit. Especially on a let's play where you don't know what the fuck's gonna happen next. It's usually why these videos take a bit longer than normal. <coughs> Just in there. Nothing and nothing. Not even. Oh fuck. Say so what? Someone see me? Must be someone up on that corner. Yep, thought so. Get your stupid ass. You got you little asshole. It's just. Got you, yeah, so. Oh shit, didn't you realize I had my hammer on? Damn, better watch out for that. Get some hammer time up in there. Oh, is this going to be a camper? Oh, not this time. I don't know where this guy is up there. This guy down the end. Just need him to stand up. Stand up. Oh, he's coming. Ah. Ooh, I was just about to go through there too. Uh, yeah, fuck it. Let's beef up on this brick. Oh, fuck me. So powerful, man. But they do operate in the whole yokai pooling on the ground too, so if you can get rid of that you've gotten rid of half of the threat alright, alright don't worry, you're next the 
the poison down on them is ticking away. Might as take that you ass hat. And I've got him slowed now. Finish him off. And that's the whole plan with just, especially for early game like I am now. I'm not going to keep the shurikens, but even though my actual shuriken itself isn't doing much damage, it's the poison ticking away that helps. And when you've got that coupled up with slow, it's ticking away. It's not a bad little, um, little bad little combination, so. Alright, so that's this dark round purged. That was the way back down. Yep, yep, and yep. I was thinking of doing a walkthrough for this, but... Not quite sure how I'd actually put that together. Probably not since just the fact that it's just such a big game. I think there was a chest down here, wasn't there? Gotta get that loot. It's in one of these houses. Oh, maybe not. I thought I saw a chest. I did too, there you are. Beautiful, lucky I got that, the ninja locks. Oh, that's right, I got ninja too. Oh, I'm gonna pick up here. Oh, this is gonna be... I do want to get Raj in one. Ground fire for later. I do want to get to that too, but we haven't got the... The mastery of the skills to learn it, so I might just make my way over to Quick Change Scroll. Oh, that's pretty good. You know, that's why I'm trying to work up ninjutsu just to get to Quick Change Scroll. That's pretty much it. Tiger Ring, I guess I could put that up too. Oh crap. Um, I think I'm just going to put a bear, I think. Bear is such a useful move pretty much like a cornerstone of my build. If I can get down there down as, for, as, as far as possible then it's just going to be even easier. So Barrier Talisman and the Lightning Talisman are obviously going to be my cornerstone of my build. Oh wait, hold on. What was that? Oh loot. How do I get up there? Is there a ladder up here or something? Oh, more loot. Nothing survives. Been over there. Oh, this is that ladder. Nothing back here. Nothing behind there. But yeah, I was going to try and make a lightning based build. Because lightning seems to be just. The fact that it can slow means I don't really need sloth, because I was going to include that too, but. You gotta get pretty deep in the Omnio tree to get that, so. Or is it the ninjutsu tree? Yeah, eat that, you long haired bitch. Oh, fucking bitch, take that. Yeah, so the more I actually use up my Omnio and ninjutsu and all that kind of stuff, it actually, you know, ticks it over bit by bit, so. Here we go, here's the loot. Pretty easy stuff. Should be right. Don't think I missed anything. Like, I, if I had Amrita sensor on, make it a bit easier. Well, we can't be. How are we doing for time? 24. We'll go up a little bit further. Oh nice, there's a thing right there. Your beauty. Okay, so there's a way down there to go. Also a way down there. And this place just looks big too, fuck. I get the inky, I feel like I've got heaps of those lately. Just leave it out for now. Uh, I do want to try and get strength and stamina up. I really want to try and get, I think it's 
stamina to six and strength to seven. Because I think the Yorkie moveset, the one that ticks over when you kill someone, it's just this part of the game. Oh, what the hell? We just saw that through the leaf. Having a something that ticks back some of your health over time, especially in the early parts of the game, it's just so good. You can always respec later, I guess. Oh, there's a fucking dickhead right down there. Got you. So we've got a snake lady, a snake lady down there. Looks like there might be just a thing up there too. Oh, yeah, I don't. Hey, what the shit? What the hell is that? I can't even see it. Anyway, I know there's an item down there. I'll just kick this down first. I saw one as I walked in. That little bastard. Alright, where does this lead to? So there's a loot there, another snake lady. Crap, how many snake ladies are there down here? She's going around, so let's just grab this. I will eventually come back here. I maybe we should just kill this bitch first. Oh, fuck. Cool. See, now that she's been slowed too, it's just that good just to try and get her, because it's just her attacks that spring out, that's all it is. Just like a snake. It's got that fup fup. Oh wait, is this? I think it is. Yeah, now this was the other path we went to before the dark realm. Yeah, I think it was. I thought we really either just cut straight through there to get the fucking shrine. There's way down there. But I think there's something on that back ledge. I can see a Kodama on my sensor as well, so. Let's see if I can get this first. Without being seen. You know, my bow reticle was saying that there was an enemy down there, but I didn't see anyone. Oh, there is a snake lead. No, wasn't it up more? I can see an item of the far left. Back left, but... Oh, I did it again. Yeah, just apply that slow and it'll make it a lot easier for me. Oh. Fucking, fucking dude. You little bitch. You little guckies go. Nope, be can't hide forever. Okay, so that guy we killed before was there. There was ah, there's the item. Now there's one up the back there. Pick up this one first. It said there was an enemy up here though. I don't see no enemies. Killed by one of those snake chicks. Oh fuck! Scared the shit out of me. Hmm. Let's beef up over here. Start off short. Try and apply some slow. Just a whiff completely. God, every time. Oof. That least just saved my life. Slow now. Oops. 
nice and nice. You son of a bitch. Alright, well that's this area cleared, I reckon. I reckon that's from the last item. If we just head on back to the sh uh, shrine, we should be alright. Like I got the Kadama down here. Got all the items, I didn't see anything there. Killed everyone. So we're looking in a good stead. We should probably just head back to the... How do we do Oh my god, over 30 minutes. Damn. That's a shrine. We're going to go that way next. Oh god. Damn. Okay, well, let's just down here real quick. Oh fuck. The fucking... Karaha, or whatever the fuck they're called. Tengus, fuck that shit. Might need someone to help me take him out. Well, anyway, guys, I might, just, might as well just wrap up here. We're on about 31 minutes, so please, if you did enjoy this one, remember to smash the like button because it helps out the channel. If you're new, feel free to subscribe because I'd love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comment section below. Thanks a lot of y'all for being uh, sticking around. This has been taking a while. And as always, guys, stay noisy.